Welcome back to another video. Today we are possibly building. We'll see. We'll see. We're in the space right now. Dogs are up here. And oh my gosh. Oh yeah, this morning Colt was loving watching people as they walked by. Uh, he's just chilling on the other side of the curtain when that was across. We are evaluating our space options here. And while we have such a such a nice view and the weather isn't so great, we're looking at uh well, what do we want to do with this space specifically? Because if you guys recall our layout, this, uh, basically from this window uh, and then the equivalent of three windows, is going to be the bathroom. We've already made a change and made an order based on that change. <laughs> um, so more on that to come. Um, but now we're like, okay, well, I don't think we're going to change what was going to be here. Uh, we want this to be the electrical closet. And as you can see right now, <laughs> It is not. <laughs> it's still a wheel well. And so we are going to box this area out. That is something that we can do today with what we have. I'm uh, going to box this area out. And then I think that we might have enough plywood. I hope that we do. To at least get us a platform. And then based on that, uh, we can we might need some L brackets if we didn't. I cannot recall where the heck those went. I think we, have, we might have them. No, we might have them with all the wires and, and storage. I have no idea. They're uh, something like 59 miles away. So <laughs> somebody might get more of those. And and then, you know, once we have these guys in, how what's the most efficient way to use the space, right? So um, we've got a lot of tools. It would be nice to have the tools there. And then it would also be nice to have a bigger bank of batteries, potentially, right? This is only 600 amp hours. We'd like to do much more. And then we still need to keep a space open for our solar wiring. We might want to do, I don't know about a window delete necessarily, or two window deletes, uh, but that could be an option for us. Um, or we do really, shelves. Can't really delete half a window. Can't really, know. <laughs> I mean, you could. I was like, it'd be nice to like, still keep the top window, but delete the bottom window, but. You could potentially just put a piece of, but then you can't, oh, you can't get to the latch on the inner side, so. You can't open it, yeah. So, so you know, I, we're looking at our options, because it would be nice, you know, we also have, this space here you know we, we could do some hooks there um and then we are going to potentially do a little um uh, close closet. storage hanging close you know yeah. yeah as well as one on this side you know so that's uh yeah, that's kind of what we're considering right now but i think we're going to start measuring just to build a little box we're going to start with that and um go from there yeah Lofty goals. Lofty goals. <laughs> now, if you look at these batteries here, these are all 12 volt, 206 amp hour. Uh, they're just sock branded batteries. And uh, we would like to, at some point, potentially go with a 48 volt system. But with 48 volt systems, you have to have, uh, I mean, you could do two 24 volt batteries or uh, what's more common is the four 12 volts uh batteries right but you don't want to add you know these are two we had these with our integra steam uh so these are two years old maybe a little a little bit older uh and they have a little exercise on them as they should um, and there's nothing wrong with them at all but i hesitate to add a fourth battery here so i think for this setup we are going to stick with these batteries um we're not going to try to add any anything extra just so we don't stress that one out um or stress these out somehow, you know, um, even though they might be perfectly good. But the cool thing is, is that we can actually go across uh, this way, which will keep a lot of space here. Um, you know, it's not going to be any wider than the wheel well, and we're going to come out just a slight bit past uh, this wheel well. So we've got some options, which is really nice. And then from here, we're going to have our inverter and our converter charger will be, you know, not far, probably just on this side. Uh, it's what we're looking at and then we can also put our solar charge controller um somewhere in here maybe right like that so right now that's looking pretty dang good i think um uh, and at the end of the day i want it all very clean and accessible so but i like the idea of putting them you know side by side uh, instead of going this way Here we've got Woodby Island uh, Naval Air Station or Woodby Naval Air Station not far from us here but inside we've got all of our pieces so, uh, far. so yeah we need so far yeah uh, we haven't done the plywood but this will at least give us a frame for this box lots of uh, little cuts here but I will say 
DeWalt definitely makes some of the best, uh, like the blades and the uh, drill bits that we've used from uh, DeWalt. Those have definitely been the best. Uh, I bought like third party, usually like I'd buy the nicer tools and then like third party, you know, that doesn't seem to be working as well for us, uh, surprisingly, so. All right, now we are going to go through these floors. Uh, obviously the manufacturer would not want you to do that, so. But we're gonna do it anyways. Yeah, we are. Um, It'll hold the floor in place, which is nice. Um, and we'll go uh, through our subfloor, which is good. So everything will be mounted nice and flush, but uh, we're gonna box out this wheel well. Here goes nothing. Our first screw. Yeah, that is tight to the last person. Yep. Sure is. <laughs> nothing to it. 100% this thing will be overbuilt <laughs> for what it is. Uh, not a bad problem to have. And we're probably doing it wrong, so you don't have to tell us that. Oh, for sure. But we cut a couple more of these six inch pieces. Um, so we'll have some supports. This thing will definitely carry well over three, 400 pounds. Um, yeah, there, there's a couple of these pieces, including the uh, the bottom fr of the frame. I don't even know if they were necessary, but if you look at how RVs are built, certainly unnecessary. Uh, but uh, we don't want to build like RVs, so <laughs> we've definitely uh, taken a look at uh, some of the units that we've owned, and yeah, they didn't they didn't build with us like bottom the bottom piece here, but I think that's okay. We can always screw into it later too. So and this front end will be closet, and so yeah. it'll be a nice to have like a wall like support and walls and things in that. Yep, yep. So let's we're gonna start pocket uh, hole screwing in here. Uh, we'll build the top part and then just screw it all down into the uh, the support here. Would you look at it? <laughs> all right, so we are in. We are in. Look at that. I ain't going nowhere. Yeah. So we've got. I still think this might be a little more support than we really, really need now. This center bar, I would like to have put more here, but there's just not a great way to do it. And we're not sending like screws towards the top. Like, it's not gonna happen. So uh, this is definitely going to be enough to support our battery bank and uh, inverter, converter, maybe some tools. And so we've got a piece of plywood we might throw on there real quick. And if then- it, If it fits. If it fits, it sits. Yes, same stuff for uh, good, good five, what, five eighths of an inch? Five yeah, pretty good stuff. Uh, a little long, so we're gonna trim it down. Thankfully, we brought these stanchions. These were, uh, I think, 15 bucks for a set or something like that, or 30 bucks. Saw horses? Yes, saw horses. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. And uh, honestly, I don't think that Craftsman makes the quality of tools that they used to. Uh, these are awesome. They're lightweight, they're uh, cheap, and they're decently durable. So we're actually going to stain this uh, black because uh, I don't want to install batteries on this and uh, you know, I know it would suck you to pull everything back out right so uh, we're gonna do this one in uh, in our stain that we we should have some stain left right I think so. probably double check that first but I think this is my favorite part. Got a layer applied. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. And uh, hopefully it doesn't rain and birds don't poop on it. So give this a few minutes to dry and then we'll set it inside. We're losing light fast, but we have our piece installed. Just putting a couple more screws. This thing is going nowhere. So, and yeah, that's a platform project. So I guess, you know, I keep wanting to say that it's the first thing that we built, but really this is the first thing. Uh, but this is kind of our first built-in furniture. Eh? So uh, yeah, we also, this Craig Jig business, love it, absolutely love it. We now know, let's take a look at these. What we've used the most of is really these uh, these two and a half inch, um, we're gonna get more of these. These are indoor, outdoor, if they're blue like that, which is kind of cool. We're not using as many of those, uh, only because uh, we wanted to save these, but might just pick up one and a half, two and a half. We haven't used as many, the one in the, you know, yet. So um, that's a really, it's a nice little multi-pack that uh, 
it's good to, good to know. And uh, if you guys are interested, uh, just because I'd never seen any one of these used, I've just seen the effect of them, uh, and I think they're awesome. Let me know. We can just kind of at some point share like how they work, but if everybody else knows, like no sense sharing it, right? Tomorrow we will go ahead and install our batteries so that we have some power. Uh, that'll be a big, that'll be a big moment. So yeah, uh, we have to go by the L brackets first. Yes, yes, we do. Um, so we need to be able to attach those batteries safely and then we'll screw everything else down around it. So uh, anyways, tomorrow will be another big day. So small things. Little uh, little bits of progress every day. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Bye.